Hi, Nicole Young here to show you some of the video editing features in Photoshop CS6. First of all, editing video in Photoshop is no longer limited to the extended version of Photoshop. So if you have the basic version of Photoshop, you can edit video too, which I think is a really great improvement. Now, in looking at the interface, we have two basic panels you're going to use when you're doing any video editing. You have the layers panel and the timeline, and they mirror each other. So if I drag and drop things around in the layers panel, it reflects that over in the timeline. I'm also able to combine clips onto one line in the timeline just by dragging and dropping. And what it does over in the layers panel is it adds them into a video group. I can go ahead and continue that by putting the last one up there. Now I have one group for all three clips. Trimming a video is extremely easy. You can just drag where you want it to go. You can see preview as well when you're actually moving that clip over. And when I release, it changes the end time of the video to basically magnetically snap to the end point of that last clip. And it does the same thing at the beginning as well. And if you want to trim something in the middle, it's going to do the same thing. Just drag and it pushes everything together. You can also add transitions by clicking on the transitions icon. Select the one you'd like to add to your clip. Select the duration and then just drag and drop. Now if I were to play this, you'll see a nice fade into that next scene. Now this really just scratches the surface of the video editing possibilities inside of Photoshop CS6, but they've really made some great enhancements and I think it's going to be a lot easier and more accessible for most people to edit video inside of Photoshop.